And we are back with another episode of my Sims 4 Crazy Let's Play. In the last episode, everything went wrong. Like, if you guys didn't watch that video, you need to go watch that video. The house caught on fire. A vending machine fell on him. Like, so much has happened. So now, let's get into it. You know, I completely forgot that we were washing last time. So we actually need to, like, switch out our laundry. What is he doing right now? React to first snow. Okay, feel free to go do that, but is the laundry clean? It's clean. So add to dryer. You can sleep later. Just go put these in the dryer real quick. Start the dryer, clean the lint tray, and then dry the laundry. All right, now let's go to sleep since you're so tired and we'll wake up and we'll do some fun. His apartment is still a mess. Like I want to get that situated today if we can. I'm in the mood for retail therapy. Want to come haggle your heart out of the flea market. I guess it's the randomizer challenge, right guys? Flip a coin. Tails. Tails it is. That means we are gonna get our sleep. He has a vacuum on him, correct? He does. What is his needs? All right. His needs are terrible, awful. We need to repair that. That way we can get something. Hopefully he doesn't start a fire. Okay. Let's just have a quick meal. Some chicken nuggets. Let's go to the bathroom. Let's take a shower. All right, then we are gonna go work on his fun for sure. Where are you going? You need to vacuum in here. All right, let's just vacuum. You gotta step on it? I thought you could just vacuum it up. Vacuum and vacuum. Why, where are you going? Where are you going? Get in here and step on, like step on this, vacuum it up, do whatever you gotta do, but just get it done. And it's snowing outside and you have on a little shirt and vacuum this. Look, I'll help you out and I'll throw that away. All right, now you can go. No, you're not going to that computer. You got to go upstairs to one of these computers. Let's play a game. Let's play Blick Block. Like, who's this? <laughs> Lucas. Oh, he's the kid that lives on the first floor. I don't think we've met him yet, right? Well, let's just get our fun up first. Let's worry about one thing at a time. Hey, I heard you and Kari are good friends now. You're getting more popular. Clearly, you're a good person to know. Thanks, Blake. It's Guy's Night at the Bar. Bar the oak barrel. See, I need to find an easier way to do this because I can be taking my phone off every two seconds. Heads or tails? It's tails this time. Sir, you're looking out for me because we got to get ours. Stuff up here. All right, your needs are full. Your fun is full. What table are you setting? Because I don't even know. Let's see, what can we do? Like, this is the first time in days that our needs are, like, pretty decently. Let's come down here and get our laundry. And, you know, it's Sunday, 11 o'clock. Oh, he's hungry now. But I was going to say we should go... We can do a quick meal. Not a quick meal, but like a like a macaroni and cheese. Dude, you didn't even finish your homework. But I was gonna say, we should go to like thrifty and like build us some outfits that we can sell online. Well, it, it's now it's in the morning. You know, I didn't realize the time it is, so let's just let him do his homework. Then, then, you know, we can go do something tomorrow after school. It feels good to actually have his needs up for once. Look, see, it's a sign. Come check out thrifty. We just got some news, some new exclusive items here at our thrift store. Remember, here today, gone tomorrow. Don't miss out. Like, we got to, like, get over there. Let's, let's get rid of this stuff. We need to make some money. That's what we got to do. All right. You know, I honestly think we were losing all of our needs because of school. Why is he embarrassed already? Need never-ending embarrassment from Social Bunny Post. What Social Bunny Post? Uh, oh, my God. He's been, he's been at it a lot. All right. I went a little too hard. It was supposed to be just a friendly pillow fight. That was three hours ago. At 5 a.m., what are we doing having a pillow fight? Isaiah, fun fact. Cow plants always get left out, which is why they suffer from severe boo moo. And he posted that two times. Or that's Jonathan. Jonathan, I need you to get it together. Isaiah, we should hang out sometimes. Isaiah, what's up, buddy? Isaiah, have you thought about taking up guitar? I think you'd crush it. Your follower count and you are the same, a big zero. Well, you know, Ashley, that was like super mean. But, you know, she wants to hang out, so we should definitely hang out with her. We should, we should plan that. Let's go ahead and be, send a mean message to her. Please just go back to your house and remove the door. No one wants to see you in public. Okay? Okay, Isaiah. And we're going to send a flirty message to her. Let me take you to Plum Bite Pier. I've got a seat on the cuddle carts reserved just for you. Boom. What is this? What is this now? Furry of the Trolls from a social bunny pose. Some people can just be so mean. All right, let's come study for exams, I suppose. We should find Corey, or is it Kari? I'm not really too sure how to pronounce her name. Somebody let me know. But here she is right here. We should, we should talk to her. Somebody's in that locker. 
Weirdo. Weirdo. Okay. We should give her some props while we're just standing in the middle of the cafeteria writing in our notebook. Our, like, lease, you know, like, is running up in a sense. Obviously, we're still going to live there throughout the school year until we become, until we age up. Because once we age up, we have to age out. Like, we have to move out. Get the next set of teens in there. All right, hurry up and finish your exam studies, bro. Uh, You're going to miss your opportunity, and you did. Uh, okay, we should get some food, though. And we should come back and talk to Corey. Kari. Like, I see, I still don't know. We get some veggie sliders. And we should find our friend. Get your food this time, and you better eat it. Like, you better eat it. All right, like, I'm watching you like a little hawk. I'm also watching to see if she comes in. Everybody is coming in here but her. Where is she? She's just sitting in class? Like, what a loser. <laughs> Let's go tell her she's our favorite. Come on. Why aren't you moving? Like, let's go. Why is she still sitting in class anyway? Like, she doesn't want to eat lunch. Tell a joke about ducks. Like, please walk over here. Like, are you not allowed in this classroom? What is he? What is he doing? Okay, well, he's still standing there. Like, let me, let me help you out. Go here. Now, go here. Uh, see, you're in the classroom now. Let's ask to cloud gaze outside in the cold. Is she broken? Like, I don't, like, I don't understand, like, why she's not working. Reset her. Let's ask her if she's a mermaid. Dude, come on now. You mi you've missed it again. How is that possible? She is, like, literally broken or something. We want to flirt with Ashley, and we want to talk to self from being erratic. Okay, well. We also want to extinguish a fire. Gutted? What? From feelings hurt by someone nearby, feeling untrustworthy cuts deep. Who did we get gutted by? Like, is it from her? Whoosh. Another classmate tosses a pencil up and it perfectly sticks into the ceiling. Everyone in class can't seem to pay attention to the board game anymore. Instead, focusing on the pencils hanging above them, this could be Isaiah's moment to shine. Is it time for him to become a class famous and stick the landing? All right, we're gonna have to do heads or tails. All right, let's flip it. Heads, all right, we got heads this time. So toss the pencil. All right, hold on. Let's see, okay, so computer, team activity, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Isaiah flicks his pencil upwards, but it fails to stick to the ceiling. Instead, it careens downward, bounces off the floor, at an awkward angle and smacks the teacher on the face. Oops, at least it didn't hit them in the eye. Small classroom performance loss. Great. Great, great, great. Isaiah, you are literally ruining your school performance to be a part of these class clowns. The school day's over. We gotta go to stupid programming now. I need to see who we were gutted by because I don't even know who that is. It can only be one person. Let's see, what's, what's our profile with her? Sentiments. We have none. Like that said, we, we have nothing with her. Can we go talk to her before she leaves class? Before, I mean, not before she leaves class, but before we, like, leave for our computer science nerd thing. He's, like, not even coming in here. Oh, there he goes. He is so depressed. Did you guys see him walking? She is not even trying to talk to him. Confidence, give props. Come on, dude. Okay, well, I guess he's leaving. He just stood next to her. He just stood next to her and basically didn't accomplish anything. Wow. I can't believe I can't believe her. We're going to call her around tonight. After our club, we're going to call her around. We have to make $748. So, the idea is to not have to pay for rent due to him, you know, being in foster care. Like, you know, the school took him in so he could, like, get his further education. That's the idea. I would like to pay for some things, but like 748 simoleons? Like, I am not paying for that. And since the idea behind the story is him being saved by the school to further his education, I am going to be giving him the money to do it, 748. And we are going to pay the bills. All right, let's just come down here and we're going to pay for it. 
If you guys leave it down in the comments if you guys like that idea or not. If you guys don't like it, then we'll earn the money to do it. But for right now, it's really just supposed to be us like getting a second chance at life, basically. He can, he can go back upstairs and play the computer, but like it is really dirty and disgusting around here. We're supposed to be calling around our friend today. I always pa I always pass her. She's right here. Invite to hang out at current lot. Let's tell her she's our favorite. You know, let's get our conversation going back. Funny, silly behavior. Give a funny gift. You know, let's do a little bit of romance, flirtation. Let's do a pickup line. Oh, she didn't like that. Oh, she did like it. Um, let's see. Ask if single. Oh, she did not like that. Yeah, <laughs> she's not liking us. She's uncomfortable. Wow, Isaiah, maybe you should just stop and go fix the toilet. She's single though. You just go up to random people on the street and ask them their romantic preferences. How rude. I thought we were friends. I thought we were friends, but I guess not. It was just in her home. She's not going to, she's clearly not the one for us. Let's just work on our needs and get this over with. I guess we'll have to go back and hang out Ashley. He wants to flirt with Ashley anyways. Handy, not dandy. Slinging hammers and nails left and right is not Isaiah's cup of tea. Should Isaiah banish this self-abuse and admit that he dislikes handiness? Heads or tails? Back again, flip it. Heads, right? You don't like handiness. We have a bug infestation? Call the landlord. How do you how do you call the landlord? We need to, no, we need to call the landlord. What, what is this? How do you call the landlord? Because I... She, did she come over here and did she do all this to us? Because she's here and all of a sudden we have these nasty bugs. I can't even, I literally cannot even like, I can only stop on bugs. But I can't call the landlord to fix my problem. Who even is the landlord? Dude, I just like, this apartment life is not good. Like it's not fun. Like how much do you have to stop on the bugs? I should really get going. Thanks for hanging out. You know, we're not, we don't have to hang out ever again. All right, there's one pile gone. Like, you have to stomp on these so much. Oh my God, it's two o'clock in the morning. Yeah, you need to go to sleep. Okay, you know, you need to go to sleep. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you, this is the worst. School is getting in our way of everything. Maybe, maybe we should just drop out. Oh my God, he's waking up because he's uncomfortable because he's so dirty. Take a speedy shower. Like, how does, how do I start the game with his, F, everything going great? And now all of a sudden, we got bug infestation. Oh my God, they came back. They came back. They came back and I don't even know how to call the landlord. I can't click on this and say, call landlord. But I just don't even know, like you can't do that, dude. You need to get up here and like solve this problem. We got $109 from that. The unit rating went up for that. The property owner sent you 109 for helping to address the issue. He sent me $109 for that. If you don't get out of my face with that nonsense. He has low energy again. He has no fun. The girl we thought we'd like, she doesn't even like us. You just in the hallway doing a tea pose. It's snowing outside and look at all you guys. Like we've never even been up here to play games. Like we always just come to school and leave the school right away. Like look how fast I got his social, or not his social, but his fun up. And he, now he can have a quick nap too. At least today's not exam day, it's only Tuesday. So that is very beneficial. Come on, 13 second or 13 minute nap. Let's go to class. Winterfest, okay, perfect. Winterfest is tomorrow, so therefore we don't have school tomorrow. Therefore, as long as nothing is like, as long as it's not like Harvest Fest, we should be fine. All right, let's come over here to lunch. And we're gonna go to this bathroom and then we're gonna steal somebody's food. Dang, how do people get over here so fast? Oh, cause we're walking like that. All right, Isaiah, hurry up. We gotta come over here and steal somebody's food. Oh, those were hers. No, leave her alone. We're not talking to her no more. She can come talk and find us. Isaiah, everybody's food is being taken. Ugh, Isaiah, you are too slow. Disorder. Disorder. You are eating that. Eat it. You sat at her table when she got up and left. All right. You're full enough. Let's go to class. Look, we're only socially down and tired. That's it. I guess we're not going to the last class. What's happening? Okay, get up and go. Sam's so quick! The teachers have collected homework and dismissed their students. Some Sims are still hanging around, but everyone is free to head home 
After noting how students performance on their homework in class, here's how everybody did. Isaiah had about as poor as a day as possible. He might as well have been absent from class. Oh, wow. Like, I don't think we should go. Like, I think we should just go home. Like, we're not going to that our after school club today. Like, can we just skip it? Vacation not needed. So we're just going to skip it. All right, get up and go home so we can go to sleep. Let's go. Let's come up here and go to sleep. Tomorrow is a holiday, so there's no big deal. Oh, he's so excited for presents tomorrow, and he don't even got no family to do presents with. Maybe we can go knock on Ashley's door and, like, hang out with them or invite, like, a little... Invite some friends over. We'll invite her. I like that he just took the ingredients out of his fridge upstairs because it kind of shows that he went to the store and, like, bought them himself, and now they're in his mini fridge to so come downstairs and use the kitchen rather than all his food just coming from here. Is he gonna go eat outside? Why is he eating outside? Like in the snow. All right, let's come, like I said, let's come knock on Ashley's door. Oh, break in. What do you mean? No, you can't get there. Chat with a crush. Who's his crush? Who's that? Chat with the crush, having a crush. It's scary, yes, but Isaiah is dying to talk to his crush. Click on Isaiah's crush and choose a social interaction. Who is that? This ramen. He has an adult on a. <laughs> he has an a. Where did he go? He has a crush an adult man, and his spouse is Bridget. Wait, Bridget, this girl? Why is his roommate? Why is her roommate an adult? What? He's already nearby. Okay, you know what? This is weird. I need to go into the town and figure figure this out because why is an adult living here who's married to this guy and where is the guy at? Like I don't I don't even know where he's at. It just says that he's nearby. Like he must be around town walking around somewhere. Why do we have a crush on a like on a stupid old man? Where if he lives here with his spouse, what bed does he sleep in? Let's just let's just go home. Let's bring him home. Actually, let's bring him home. So that way we can talk to him in person because I'm confused. Okay, he's not here though. Where is he? I suppose he didn't have to come with us, but like, rude. He's right here. Okay, he's right here. See, I knew I was not crazy. Like he wants to do what with his crush? Chat with his crush. Why is he crushing on all, all it's stinky? Like if this goes away from chatting with him. That's crazy. What is happening? Like, that is so weird. Like, I'm really just home waiting for Santa at this point. Hello, Bridget. Bleak like, does he not uh, like her because she Yoba. has a husband? Oh, so she's a genius. Oh. She's a smarty patardy. <laughs> I mean, to have a crush on ramen. All right, well, look. In conclusion, if we have a crush on him, right? This just means our Sims gate. And we are, we've been trying to get with Corey for no reason. And you know, Ashley, she likes us. So basically we need to go after somebody who's, you know, we have good compatibility with. And I think that's Jonathan. I say we forget these, these people, like forget Ramin, Ramin, and let's like go after Jonathan. He is like the thrifty guy. You know, he probably has outfits and do that. He probably makes a lot of money. Cause like, I am disgusted by this. Hey, I heard you and Ashley Colt are good friends now. You're getting more popular. Clearly, you're a good person now. But you don't even want to know us. You don't even like us. Maybe because we've always been gay and she just knew we were gay. When is Santa coming? Because I am over this. We're not getting... Maybe I can buy us the gift pile. Come add some presents. Come add some presents. Come shake some presents. And we'll just say that it's like from a friend. I don't know. Oh, no. Don't put that in your inventory. Let's open up... Woo! He will treasure it. The gifts can be found in either the Simpsons or the house or whatever. One tray. Chick perfume set. The cat is here, guys. Do you see that? The cat is here. And he almost just fell off the table. Hey! You taking my microphone with you, dog. Now, let's see what this is. Let's sweat. What a rush. This boost of adrenaline is making Isaiah feel amazing. Embraces astonishingly sculpted arms that he likes fitness. 
See, I always want to say yes to these things, but it is the random challenge. So, flip again. Tails. No, you don't need a life fitness. Well, we completed the holiday. When does Santa come around? Because that's pretty much all I'm waiting for. Because I kind of want to go to the thrift, the thrift store. So I think we might just have to go. I also invited Jonathan here. So we can give... Oh, no, I forget. We can't give him no winter press gift because it's one of those. But let's... About fashion. Let's see what's trending. Oh, no. Okay, I didn't mean to do that one. Then. How do I figure out which things is trendy again? I thought you clicked on here, but it just says about fashion looks. Let's just create a fashion look. Forget it. We're just going to create our own fashion look. We're not going to know what's trendy right now. We'll figure that out later. i never done this before, so let's just see, like, what we can we do? We're very limited on our outfits right now. And we don't even have swatches to all of them. And I think that's good. Like, that's very limited. So it's winter. It's cold. I feel like we should do some kind of sweatshirt. Wait, sweat? This is a sweatshirt? This little jacket? This is not a sweatshirt. Okay, well, I was going to say we should do some kind of you know warm outfit but like this is this is threw me off i don't even know so let's just do something like this an open track jacket because we know we got the zipped up one let's do an open one for school you know maybe we can sell it to our classmates nice burgundy so right now our our item costs 85 dollars style base so this is basics so we want it to be white everywhere i don't even know Y2K, it's literally just some shoes and some jeans. Y2K in a basic style, let's do it. All right, $85, now let's see if we can sell said outfits. Sell on Trendy. Enterprise, similar fits are selling for 85, so that's how much I bought it for. So we'll just put it for 85. We'll just make an even rate off the sea. All right, well, we got our first outfit. Bess, what do you want? Do you wish you looked as happy as I do? Well, you have the power. Just send one simoleon to me. Don't delay happiness. Just a simoleon on the way. You guys already know the drill. Heads or tails? Tails. Sorry, Bess. Sorry, Bess. Hang up. But our telemarketing scam was click. All right, let's go home because I really want to see Father Winter. Let's add to Instagram story. Like, let's keep doing that kind of stuff. You know, just ate a piece of cake. <laughs> let's come up here and let's see. Social networking. Check social media timeline. How else can we earn money? We can find odd jobs. Some odd jobs right here. Moving furniture. I want to move some heavy furniture into storage. Or should I say, I want you to move some heavy furniture into storage. We can do that. Oh, it begins right now. Which I think we can do. For, look, skills none. Let's do this one. Moving the furniture. 24 an hour. I mean, this one is now. But I don't know what level we are in charisma. So, 20, so if we do this, we're like guaranteed, like, you know, whatever. Please. Oh, Father Winter's here. Father Winter's here. Hello, Father Winter! Friendly introduction. All right, here we go. Moving things isn't especially glamorous. Nor is it particularly fun. Isaiah got the job done, but that's pretty much it. Move things, get money. That's how it works. Outcome 96, $4 tip. Perfect. Because I want him to build his own gaming setup. Why do we just have a negative reaction with Father Winter? Okay, well, let's, let's talk to him. Let's get our social up. Oh, our social is up, but... We're not going to fight him or nothing. We're going to ask him for a gift. So urban legend, deep conversation. He gave us a starter vegetable. Oh, that is, that is real. That is just real something, you know, real raggedy. Oh yeah. So he put more gifts in there. So we're, we'll look at him in the morning. Time to bed for bed. He's taking our drinks. He's dirtying up our apartment. That's messed up. Winterfest was awesome. Isaiah had a wonderful time and got to do everything he planned to. He just came in here and he like just literally dirtied up our whole apartment. Like three. Like that is just so raggedy of him. Oh my gosh, we cannot vacuum this. So I'm going to have to scoot that. I'm going to have to scoot this over so we can vacuum it. What is it intersecting with? All right, let's just put that outside. <laughs> Open present. Let's see what Father Winter left us. All right. 
Let's see, what do we have in our inventory that we got? It would throw, throw that away. I'm assuming everything else is inside of our household inventory then. So we got, we only got this. I'm pretty sure. Like, did we get this from prom? I don't know if, if we got anything from prom, but we could totally sell that because we have another prom coming up. This, I don't know what we're gonna do with that, but that could stay there for now, I suppose. Let's go downstairs and let's make something else again for, because we gotta go to school today in an hour. So might as well come down here and get some food. What is he doing? Like, does he need to be doing all this? Because now you gotta go. Now you gotta go to school. Like we just wasted four dollars for what? Because you ran around trying to clean up everything. All right. So, did we do our homework? We don't even have the homework on us. Okay. Well, that is just fantastic. We gotta find out which guy is gonna be our new boyfriend now. All right. Branding. One of the most important parts of marketing something is how it's branded. At least according to the teacher in class today. Part of the class assignment is to take an original brand and present it to the class. Isaiah figures this could go one of two ways. Either try a serious brand or make it a complete joke. Let's see. Uno, dos. Let's flip it. Tails. Make a funny brand. Isaiah is greeted a little bit of confusion and a lot of yawning when a... a when as he presents his brand idea, maybe his humor collaboration was a bit off. Small classroom performance lost. Isaiah, you keep losing performance. All right, travel to the for career day. Let's go. Let's see what kind of careers we can get ourselves into. Culinary career. Ask for details about career. An athletic career. Ask about details. And was this criminal? Finding Spino, you have to make kisses. Ask for details. We're gonna ask about all the details. She doesn't even like us to begin with, you know. Scared? Now he's scared. Future uncertain. There was no career paths that caused his fancy. The future remains unclear and frightening. We're not going to this computer geek stuff no more. I feel like we should quit. I'm just throwing it out there. I feel like we should quit. Let's do some friendly stuff. Let's talk about hobbies. Talk about the sunny weather. Is it even sunny? I suppose it is getting sunny. It's not snowing. Career day is about to end. Oh, he likes video gaming. We like to play video games. All right, well, we're, we've been talking to this guy for a little bit, but I suppose it's over now. All right, I suppose we'll go. It's because we're tired. Like, I don't want to go to that thing if we're tired, but I suppose we'll go. All right, let's get his needs fixed up. Oh, his food is still right there. Eggs and toast. Oh. Man, we have to relist our we have to relist our outfit. Hey, I got a special gift for you because you're such a good neighbor and I appreciate your kindness and friendship. Want to see what it is? Okay, wait, hold on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go, 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 go. What is our gift? What? <laughs> what is the gift, girl? <gasps> Hello? Have you heard of something called the motive trials? Apparently, they take a bunch of sims and put them in some remote place and let them battle it out like royal. Do you think you'd want to be a part of something like that? Count me in only if it lasts for Fortnite, guys. Look, we're gonna flip the, the thing. And if it's anything but heads, we're still gonna go. <laughs> Count me in. Well, that let's, okay, wait. Well, then let's get going. I'll be waiting at the secret location. Okay, you guys probably missed it because I still had the chrome open. But I accidentally pressed X on the thing Corey invited me to. So now I'm sad. And because of that, I'm going to end off the episode here. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode, leave a like. And if you've watched this far, consider hitting that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace!